Hello students, this is Megan Tin. Today, our lesson is all about cell membrane and cell transport. All cells have cell membranes that serve as flexible barrier. Function Maintain homeostasis within the cell. Cell membrane or plasma membrane, composed of two layers of phospholipids with embedded proteins. With hydrophilic head or water loving and hydrophobic tail that repels water. The fluid mosaic model explains the structure of the cell membrane. Cell membrane structure composed of glycoprotein, carbohydrate, glycolipid, cholesterol, integral protein, peripheral protein, channel protein, alpha helix protein, and globular protein. hypertonic and a hypotonic solution. Take a look at these red blood cells and the effect of different solutions. Let's figure out why sometimes a red blood cell stays the same, sometimes it shrinks, and other times it swells. To begin with, it'll be helpful to know the difference between a solvent and a solute. Let's look at coffee. The solvent is what the solute is dissolved into. The water is the solvent, and the cream, sugar, and coffee are the solutes. Now, in our example, we're going to use salt water. In the example, the blue circles is the solvent water, and the white circles are the solute salt. An isotonic solution is equal. Iso meaning equal, and tonic meaning strength. So the solute and the solvent will travel in and out of the cell equally, and the cell will stay the same. It's equal. Now, a hypertonic solution is different. Hyper meaning above, and tonic meaning strength. And notice that there are more salt or solute than solvent outside the cell. As a result, you have a higher concentration of solvent inside the cell so the solvent travels out of the cell and the cell will shrink. The solvent always travels from high concentration to low. Now, hypotonic, hypo meaning below, tonic meaning strength, and notice there are very little solute outside the cell and a higher concentration of solvent outside the cell. So the solvent flows into the cell, remember high to low, and the cell will expand. I hope that's been helpful in knowing the difference between isotonic, hypertonic, and hypotonic. 